But still, I think uh, they're a little bit undermanned today as we see Shine bring it back towards full forward. They're waiting for Kernahan to set himself, couldn't take the mark. That comes loose to Aspen, he steps at the goals! It's a... And up high. <laughs> Peter Rowe. High, the forward line, one grab. Can't complete it, Kenny. Snares it, oh, beautiful handball to Ashman. He dummied in wonderful style, and Ashman has goal. Thank you to Peter Kenny, because that's who the goal belongs to. Well, 5-5, five, five. Carlton plays Hawthorne 4-5. We're seeing... Murphy uh, has a chip. It's punched to take it away by Richmond. Carlton again through the agency of Rodney Ashman, and Ashman puts the goal through for the Blues. Taken to attack, and they look dangerous. Williams to Johnston on his natural boot. Now Ashman can go for home. The Blues are in front. Waterson. No, it's not allowed. Crocomiel has boots the Blues forward. Ball favours uh, Mark Thompson. Ashman right with him. He's got him too. Good tackle, Ashy. Didn't give up. Holding the ball. Good play, Ashman. Did not give up. Now out comes Hunter. Donnell in pursuit. Ashman out in front now of Thompson. Sells him the dummy. Can line them up. And goal! Great skill from the veteran Rover. Madden to the opposition in Johnson. Johnson quickly back to Ashman. Got it again. Boy, Mark Thompson has been a good player, is now uh, in tatters. Bit of Bradley, Bradley in turn back to Dean. Dean up towards Blackwell at centre field in front of Bolton. His kick is a high one down towards uh, left centre wing. Kernahan gets the pass back again to Blackwell. Blackwell's gone for a pass on his own. Rod Ashman, he could score from there. Long shot by the Carlton Rover. That's a goal. Great play, Carlton. The Blues hit the front. Great goal, a great blue with a long one. But there's no one there for uh, Carlton. Oh, that was foolish, but I think he spotted some well smothered by Johnson, picks it up all right, ducks. He's clear now, another long hand pass, Ashman taps it over to McClure, can't pick it up, it'll bounce, okay, great play. Chance for a goal, now he's gone for a hand pass, back to Ashman, runs to the open, goal, third level. Oh, that was good play, but tackle that time by Shiny, pinned uh, Williams down, but the umpire said it'll be a free kick, and they're at it again. Well, I don't know if it was a push in the back of what it was. The umpire seems to think that uh, Shine was at fault, so he's given the free kick there to Williams. So it was a good tackle. Short pass. Up goes Aspen and takes a fight mark there in front of uh, Mitchell. So he's got the ball down there, short of the uh, back pocket position. Scores dead level, 47 points apiece. As the ball is kicked back there to Weinmark with the front punched on again by Kernahan. A hand pass picked up by Meldrum again. A long hand pass to Johnson. Over it goes to Aspen. This could be a goal. No, it'll be marked by Kernahan. He's only about two metres out from goal on a very acute angle. Could easily kick this one. Can't take the mark. Thump down. Back again. Pass full forward. And Ashman has the chance. Receives the handball. Fires towards goal and puts it through. So Rod Ashman kicks his first. And the Blues offer the quick reply. Job, is no, it? He's getting a few kicks, but he's, uh, at this stage he's being beaten by Conlon. Taken by Ashman. The kick very high. Bradley's turn. Uh, he gets the ball moving into the forward pocket. A charge for Carlton. And that this was Carlton's got this shot at goal now through Ashman because Dwyer made the mistake of going out wide before instead of going straight down the ground. Entirely, Jack. I get it anywhere near centre half forward. I reckon you've got to go straight at the goals because not only if it drops short, there's still pressure on the defence. You kick it wide, there's no real pressure because it's too far from goal. Here's Ashman. Stabs at this one. And I think he's put it through. A badly needed goal by the Blues. So they move on to three goals, six, 24, trailing Fitzroy, 6-5, 41. We're 24 minutes now into the second term. Ashman on screen after kicking that goal. I don't think he's that fit either, as I said before. But he's out there playing, so he'll have to do his job. Here, picked up by Fraser Murphy, up toward the half forward zone. Ashman back on the ground, was tackled Touched too high. The boot. Yeah, but he was tackled too high, I'm saying. Peter was grabbed around the neck, yeah. and the umpire hasn't paid it. He's so, lost his helmet too, yes. uh, by Ashman. I don't think he came on with it, I think he left it behind.
kicks it down there. Witty punches it away. Ashman comes in. Oh, straightens up Ashman. Handball to Fraser Murphy. And the dasher just rikes in and kicks the goal. How easy is it? And they're just piling them on here. Uh, six goals in the... Uh, they've kicked six goals in the... Couldn't get it. Fraser Murphy. Meldrum over to Ashman. Ashman's got uh, Elvin. He wants it. Elvin streaming down. Is it going to be his second goal from the back line? A oh, great goal, Tommy Elvin. And the Blues go on to 24-11. 155 to St Kilda. And the pack of players, what's the bidding on this being forced through from behind? Up they go. He tried to do it, Emmett Dunn. And it's kicked hurriedly by Ashman. And he's kicked it for a lovely goal. Well, that's Rod Ashman's second goal. And Carlton, oh, this is just a cakewalk, isn't it?